in the history of movies, there are a few filmmakers who have expanded our way of seeing and completely changed the way we experience the art form. One of them was named Federico Fellini. That's not enough to call Fellini a filmmaker. He was a maestro. And really, for a generation of film lovers, he was cinema. Now, Fellini's work is like a treasure chest. You, know, you open it up and there's a world of wonders, sparkling visions of beauty, terror, absurdity, where the ancient and the modern become one, where all the barriers between reality and fantasy just shatter before your eyes. Fellini's work seemed to open up new realms of possibility for me and, and all my friends, and we'd go to see his pictures the day they opened, and as we waited for the lights to go down, we knew we were going to be surprised, transported, and perhaps transformed. So from Ivitaloni and La Strada through Eight and a Half and Satyricon, he showed us the darkness that can overcome the soul, and then the magic and spiritual force that can bring you back into the light. What he gave us was priceless. And the best way we can thank him is by keeping his work alive. Thanks to Frida Giannini and Gucci for their incredible commitment to film preservation, Fellini's artistic legacy is being kept alive and well. So together with the Cineteca di Bologna and Medusa, they have made possible the digital restoration from the original negative of his 1959 masterpiece, the film that conquered the world, La Dolce Vita.